Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve or find your external hard drive on Windows 11 if you try plugging it in and for some reason it's not being detected. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So what I recommend starting with is opening up the search magnifying glass and type in disk management. Best match to come back or create and format hard disk partitions. Go ahead and open that up. Now, for the drive that you're having the problem with, it will probably not have any drive letter next to it. So it might just be blank or whatever drive you're having the problem with. So you can generally tell what drive is probably your hard drive based on your capacity size here. And you probably don't want to mess with system reserved either. So it should be a process of elimination here. Again, you should see it on here if it's not being picked up in File Explorer for some reason. And there would probably be no letter next to the name as well. So let's just say that this is our drive, for example. We're going to go right click on the driver having the problem with and you would select change drive letter and pass. There wouldn't be any drive letter in here if it wasn't being detected so it just would be blank and you would select the add or change button and then you would assign the following drive letter. Click on the drop down and you would select the drive letter you want to assign and then once you're done with that you go ahead and select OK. And then to some programs that rely on drive letters might not be able to run correctly. Do you want to continue? You go ahead and select yes. And then hopefully then your drive would be accessible and available on your computer. You may also want to consider doing a quick format on the drive as well. And that's about it. So pretty straightforward. Obviously, if you do a format on the drive, you're going to be deleting anything that's saved on it. So I do want to put that out there. But pretty straightforward process, guys. Do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.